Mickey. Mickey, you're squeezing the life out of me. You all right? What's the matter? Yes, I am. I am. Why are you going so early? One question. Today is Wednesday. And? We are leaving for Kutaka. Eh? Oh my God. No, no, no. Don't worry. I'll catch the boss. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, What's this? You know how to be back on Thursday tomorrow morning. I have an appointment. I know. I know, but please say don't go. Please listen. I, I, I can't, I can't let you... Be. Make, 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 yes. uh, I will be in the way for two days. I don't know what I'm saying. But I'll be... It doesn't call for all this drama. Listen to me, Jake. I don't feel good about this at all. I had a dream that was not so good. Jake, please, don't. <laughs> you're laughing. Jake, you're laughing. Oh, my goodness. A dream. <laughs> Is that why you're putting up all this melodrama? Jake. I, I would have, I would have felt better if you were flying. Oh, you know I have a phobia for flying. Okay, let me kneel down. Okay, I've knelt down. Now don't go. I'm begging you, please, please. Nikki, get up. Tell me you won't go, and I'll get up. Nikki, please, get up. Mm -mm. Come on, go. Come on, <clears throat> Nikki. I know how important this trip is to me. But you know I don't care about money. That's the only thing that matters to me. Take please don't do this to me now. Don't oh, go me. now. Please, no tears. You break my heart when you cry. Listen, I'll be okay. I promise. You don't understand, Jake. I had a dream of It's only a dream. Nothing will happen to me. I'll be back before you know it. Okay. Okay, well, let's pray. Please, please. Come. Come. All right, please hurry up. I'm late. Okay. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, we thank you for everything you've done for our lives. Father, right now we ask that you grant him journey mercies, O Lord. Father, please bring him back to me unscathed. Let his contract be favorably sealed in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you. I'm taking you to the bus station. Oh, come on, please. It's a message to leave. I'm late. I'm ready. Let's go. Oh, God. Women. I have to be late for work. I don't want to. Please do it again, please. Do you feel like the... the white car. Oh. The boss is a fool. Besides, it's faster with a car. Yeah, what about the number of the Do you get it? Oh. Alright, here. Go home, Nikki, Nikki. Nikki. Go home, I'll be okay. Look. You begin to give an eerie feeling with this ritualistic approach to this dream stuff. I hope you're not deliberately scheming a psychological defeat on me from going on this trip. Because I am going, and that's the end of the matter! Don't get angry now. What should I be? I'll be okay, right? To be okay?
God. Ting, how could you scare me? Ah, what are you doing here? I live here, remember? Yeah, but it's supposed to be. Well, I changed my mind. I decided to heed my wife's warning. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. And you know. Mm. Why didn't you come in? I wanted to surprise you. Mm. Oh, man. What's it all this candle thing up? Oh, come on. We're just as a man. The fact that we've been married for two years doesn't mean we have to settle down to a drab life. Mm. Now, I want you to savor my cooking. You cook? Yes, of course. Oh my god. And now you don't want my cooking. Okay, no problem. It's nice to shout it. Oh my god. I'm trying. Happy? More than you can. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> oh, well, I guess we could do some sleep now. Uh, Honey? Mm -hmm. Do we have any more juice in the fridge? I guess so. Why? Please, can you help me get some? Oh, I'm tired, you know. Can't you get yourself? Oh, please. I'm tired. I don't think my legs can carry me. Oh, that's my baby. All the passengers, including the driver, were said to have died on the spot. Identity of the bodies had still not been discovered, as everything seems to have been lost in the crash. However, people who have friends or relatives that traveled this morning in a white Mr. Bushy saloon car should please come to Trinity Hospital, Ijebodi, to identify the bodies. In another development, the Federal Road Safety Commission has put a machinery in motion to ensure that road users undergo special traffic training to create greater awareness on the essence of road signs and rules in order to reduce the rate of accidents on the highway. Following this development, officials of the Commission have been put on alert and now await further direction to this effect. Thank you. Nikki. What's the matter? Nikki. Come on, 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 come on,
You are distressed right now. What do you mean? No, no, I'm telling you to get to the house right now. I told, I told him, I told him at the park this morning, a little bit of potato. Only for me to come back from work. He was right there. He was there waiting for me with cutting me dinner. Suddenly he decided not to travel. You need to get me. You made love. I went to get him a glass of juice. Only for me to hear on the news that there was an accident involving the car that he entered and, and I tried to make it, make it, make it, please. How is Don't do this, please. Don't. Don't. Please. I saw it on the news. I saw it. I recognized Jean's body as one of the bodies. You couldn't, you couldn't have been with him. You know, tricks for you. Uh, look, I think you, you don't tell me what I need and what I don't need. Yes. I'm telling you that I was take a few minutes ago. We can't even make it off. Hey, please don't do this. Ricky, Ricky, Ricky. Ricky, you yourself. Please. Please. Yourself together. Don't go crazy. I'm not using it. What's, what's happening to me now? No. You're not going mad. You're just overwhelmed with grief. No, I mean, this circumstances is understandable. Look, I think. Can, can I help you? Of course, don't let you go back to your house and sleep in. You go. Who? Tick. You go, my dear. You go there now. Nikki. Yes. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 Why are you doing this to me? Wasn't it? 
Nikki, I think, I think someone is just trying to be funny, saying his dick wants to know if you're here. Emma, I told you it's him. Don't you know his voice? Nikki, please, don't start. There's no such thing as ghosts. I'm sure someone is just trying to be stupid. Please, please, get some rest. Or, uh, really like some uh, sleeping pills? Do you want? Emma, well, what am I going to do? It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Don't tell me you're crying. I'm not crying. Don't start. I'm not crying now. I'm not crying. 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 I'm
psychological stress. Which doesn't come on in situations like this. My dear Q, I will suggest that you check into a hospital for a complete psychological analysis. At least I'll do it very well. I don't want you to lose your mind completely. Daddy, there's nothing wrong with me. Oh yes, oh yes. I do with my complete. People used to say that it is only men that are evil that must stay in their body when they pass on. And Uncheina are foremost in evil. So why should it be appearing to you everywhere? Are you sure she's got you? Why is it only you, Jenna, is appearing? Eh, don't you dare call my daughter Do you hear me? If she says she has seen the ghost of Vivienne, and she has, I'm not here. Now, when two people are in love and one dies, the other will always come to keep each other company. Oh, Jenna, my son. I wish your ghost can appear to me. Lucy, if you had not gone to school, I wonder what would have happened to you. You know, I don't believe in such things. I don't even know who invented that word ghost. My dear Nikki, I never see I want you to go and see the psychiatrist. For God's sake, Daddy, I am not mad. You don't have to believe me. No, please don't suggest that I'm mad. I'm not mad. If you are not mad, then what are you? I won't be surprised if you are connected with Jenna's death. Because I don't understand why it is only you. Jenna will want to have it. I will not take you. I'm sorry, I don't want to be too Please don't even go there. I'm sorry. 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 i am sorry i am Before he died, there was a deal he was trying to 
Frank. That will affect him the best cycle amount of money. So now his spirit is roaming around to grab that money. Shh. It is not only rumors that that money goes to do. Number two, the wife. Oh. <sighs> strong influence over him. Yes, yes. We must modify that influence. So that we can finally lay him to rest. Pastor, how are we going to do that? Uh, yes, let's come to that. I was coming to that. Uh, uh, mm, you have to bring some items. Bring them very early morning on Wednesday morning by 3.30 a.m. Not one minute before and not one minute after. If not, they will lose their potency. Uh, Pastor, what are these items? Hallelujah! Hallelujah! The left tooth of an elephant. Yeah. And a piece of white cloth newly manufactured. Yes. And a strand of hair of a newborn baby. Yes. Yes. And a cup of water. A cup of water from the spring that is both hot and cold.
Are you set? I'm almost. Let me just powder my face, you know. Well, your face is all right. No, I just need to. Hurry up now. We are losing light. I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay, I'm set. Death is rolling. Janice reporting on Ghost Action. Hi, I'm Jane Isogundeli, and you're welcome to yet another exciting edition of your fifth program, Stranger Than Fiction. Yes, this is indeed Stranger Than Fiction. Wonders they say in a Call it mysterious, call it out of this world, or simply unbelievable. Whatever classification you may prefer for this incredible, mind boggling story, a ghost is on the loose, dead or alive. That is the story of late Mr. Jacob Wango, who was reported to have lost his life in the Gaffrey Moto accident on Wednesday, the 24th of June 2000. Some members of our crew were at the scene of the accident. Now, the strange thing is that there's someone out there living in late Mr. Wango's apartment, claiming that he's not dead but alive. And quite a number of people, including his dear wife, were reported to have seen him in the past few days. Wow, stranger than fiction. Fallacy or fact. How do we reconcile the late Jacob Brown from his soul rest in peace and this other supposed Jacob running around claiming he's not dead? Well, this is the question we all must answer. Do you believe in ghosts? Is the ghost of Mr. Brown for running a mark? Some say that a ghost will disappear after the burial. We'd have to see about that, as today happens to be the burial ceremony of Mr. Jacob Nwanko, and we'll be there to bring the report on the event later on this evening on Stranger Than Fiction. Sule! Sule! What's the matter with you? Why are you standing like that? Where's mommy? Which mommy? You don't get mommy here, do you? You don't die, and that now, fine now. You don't die, finish you. I'm waiting to work out the fight. Please don't die, finish. Stay for heaven, you lost it. Go inside here, you know, please stay for there, you walk up and down. Why would not bury you finish for today? Please go there for this house. Now lie, you. Now lie. Then that place where they live, not the meat, if you are. I'm papa, so my God. For this house today. Now lie, you must get this for this house. Wait, you know that you need to stay for everybody, what else? I say, my God, 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 I God, by whose mercy rest is given to the souls of the faithful. In your kindness, bless this grave of our brother. Entrust it to the care of your holy angels. O oh God, give our own Jacob Wanko peaceful rest in this grave. Until that day when you the resurrection and life will raise him up in glory. Then may he see the light of your presence, Lord Jesus, in the kingdom where you live forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father. I'm alive. I'm not dead. I don't know who you're buried inside that place, but it's definitely not me, Jacob Putin Nawanko. I'm not dead. Vicky! Nikki, please come back, please, Nikki, please, Nikki. Excuse me, look. Please, listen. I want you to tell the world that I am not dead. I am alive. Do you understand that? Look, touch me, feel me. Come. Come, touch me, feel me. I am not dead. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh, Ghana, where you they go? Just keep, just keep trying. Something they worry your head. I said, where you they go? I said, I keep on trying. Yeah, I know where you they go now. Oh, 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 all right. Take me to, take me to, take me to Papa. A lot of taxes number 25. Now, now you they talk. Your money now, 250. <laughs> Oh God, what did they worry you? Ghost, they pursue you. I'm a ghost. Believe it. I'm a ghost. It actually feels good to be a ghost. Have you ever seen a ghost? You'll be that person. I beg you. Come down from this motor. Come down, come down, come down. You say, yeah, it's right. I said, come down from my motor. Why? I'm a carry mad people. You'll be mad person. What if I? You pull me out yourself. Oh, God, get down. Get down. Move. Oh, oh, oh. Drive. Drive it or else I'll turn it into a ghost oh. like myself. Oh. Oh. No best. No best on that. You be that person. You be better. Move it. Move No best. No best. Now you be the Move. better person where I know. Ah. Anywhere you won't go today, I will carry you go there. Even pass your papa. Move. I go carry you. We are still praying to the Lord. The Holy Book says, yes. we shall never be intimidated by our enemies. Oh, yes. Why? Why? Because just for the mention of the name Jesus Christ, every knee shall bow. Oh, yeah. That is not all. That is not all, children of God. That is not all, children of God. The signs will accompany those who believe. Those who believe, they will cast out demons. They will cast out demons. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. hallelujah. All right. They will cast out demons. Yes. And they will speak new languages. Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, yes. Holy night. Holy you God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God, the Lord is here. Yes, the Lord is here. Yeah. The Lord is here today. Yes. And he's here right now. Yes. 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 Hallelujah. Oh, oh brothers. Oh my. Oh my brothers in Christ. My brothers. Ah. Say hallelujah. Say hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, now it is time. It is time. It is time. It is time now. It is time. It is time for us to bring this prisoners from us all. Yes. And find all the girls from this house permanently. Yes. Yes. yes, yes, yes. Now, now, please. Let us put those that devil out of this house. Yes. Put those that out of this Signed in the name of Jesus Christ! Yeah. 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 
Are you crazy? <laughs> you are. You are defeated. You are defeated. You are the. <laughs> You are defeated, you demonic descendant of the devil! You grow a ton of gold! What's up? 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 What's Instead of confusing my family. God! I want you just to 
to your bed. I saw your boy for crying out loud. Sick, someone is playing games with us and Nikki's falling for him. Please, I'm alive. If you're not a ghost, how did you get in here? You left your back door open. I overheard both of you discussing downstairs. I just didn't want to alarm you. That's why I, I came upstairs and waited for you in the group, please. Iman, I want you to talk to Nikki for me, please. I miss my wife like crazy. I love her support, please. Feel me. Look. I'm alive. I don't know how you expect me to, to be convinced that you're not a ghost. Oh, gosh, please. Don't talk like that. Don't talk like that to me. What does he want? What does he want from us? I, I can't understand why. Enough. I don't. Enough.
So you have decided to come as a woman, eh? Well, I've got news for you. I'm not scared of you anymore. I've had enough of this fight. What are you talking about? Don't, don't no. pretend you don't know what I'm talking about. I've had enough of this nonsense. You have to stop this. Good woman, don't worry. You must be confusing me with someone else. I am Mrs. Priya George, and I'm here to see Mrs. Nikiru Mwanko. Are you the one? Mm. What if I am? Then I'd like to see you concerning a very important matter. Hmm? May I call you? You're assuming I'm interested in what you have to say. I can't let a total stranger into my house. I'm not a stranger. I am your mother, you know. <laughs> Do you concerning your husband, my son? Jacob Wampo, is this some kind of joke? Look, my daughter. I am tired. I have just come in from my house and I deserve at least water to bring me. Hmm? May I come in? Are you trying to tell me my husband is a twin? I had both of them when I was about 15 years old. No husband, no money. I knew what I did was criminal. Believe me, I had no choice. I'm all starved to death if I didn't do it. A friend of mine informed me that there was a couple in Portacourt who desperately needed a child and were willing to buy at a very high price. So you sold Jacob? Mm -hmm. What about the other baby? I'm coming to that. I'm not proud of what I did. I sold him. See, the couple that bought him knowing of the existence of the brother. I couldn't part with both of them. I just bought him now. <laughs> it was bad enough. So I'm so warm. I used the money I was given to put up the trade that enabled me to care for Pelemo. Was that his name? My husband is a job, mm. not Igbo. Peremo was the one that died in that accident. <laughs> when did he come back from Lagos on the day inside the world? I was worried. But then I thought he decided to stay with his friends as he sometimes did. After four days, I became very worried and was preparing to come to Lagos when I had a report on the news of a ghost being on the loose. And all the publicity the story had generated it was fair. It was then I realized that my son Pepperno was there. <laughs> That's the other fellow. That's the other fellow keeps insisting that he was not a ghost. I then 
I put two and two together and I write that four. My God. I didn't know they were identical. You <laughs> didn't. I saw him when he was three weeks old. <laughs> you can't really tell at that time. Oh God. Oh. What have I done? Didn't you try to contact Jake? Why? Because I promised myself that my friend who I went to say is that I'll never look for or try to contact him. I, I thought it was better for both parties involved. I guess you're right. Oh, God. My poor husband. He's, he's, he's been through so much lately and, and now this! <laughs> that is why I have come. Not only to claim the body of my son, <laughs> but to also clear the air as people are still running away from him thinking he was a ghost. Oh my poor, my poor friend, I'm, I wish he really <laughs> had seen him before he died. I saw him on that report. Oh, they were so much alike. Even I would have found it very difficult to differentiate them. So, um, what are we going to do now? Are, are you are you going to lay claims on him? No. I don't do that to the people he has regarded as parents all these years. I wish, I wish I didn't have to let him know. But that's the only way to clear this mystery. Um, I suggest we go over to his parents' house and let's, let's just leave a note for him here to meet us there. I, I think it's better if everyone is present, please. Okay, okay. Oh, Lord. I wish I didn't have to do this. Don't believe it. I don't believe you use me as a pawn and a chessboard. How could you strike me like a dog? I'm sorry, Jacob, but I had no choice. I needed the money to stay alive. We would have all starved to death so if I didn't do it. why didn't you sell him? Or the two of us? How could you have been so heartless? And you, Dad, why didn't you tell me? I'm sorry, Jacob. I couldn't have told you. But whether I bought you or not, you're my son. And I did not want you to think otherwise. Do you know that what you did was criminal? Do you realize that all of you could go, could go to jail? How could you batter him? You and me? How could you? Okay, please, please come. Don't you touch me. Don't you ever touch me. And don't you ever come near me. You, you made me almost lose my job. But, but Jake, how, how, how can you say that now, Jake? I, 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 wasn't, I wasn't trying to... I, I can, and I will. Do you know what made me be with you? Do you know? What were you when I needed you? You ran away. Tell everybody, I'm a ghost, I'm a ghost. But they don't give me the chance to explain. Well, I, I couldn't help it. The, the circumstances were... The circumstances, damn the circumstances. When you love someone, you stuck at that person at all time. Under any given circumstance. I don't want to see you face again. Or anybody else in this room. Keep away from me. Don't come near me. I will send your things to you to be moved to you. Jake, Jake, please wait now, Jake! Are you satisfied now? Why didn't you just remain where you were? If I didn't come, wouldn't you have still been running from pillar to post thinking it was a ghost? She's right. Okay, um, listen, let, let's not quarrel about this. Everybody is upset right now, and, and rightly so. I think we should all go to bed, and um, I'm sure things will sort themselves out, please. You're right, my daughter. We all need rest. It's been quite an experience. You can't say that again. 
Now, why didn't you tell us that Jacob was a twin? Look, Mrs. Ronko, I'm sorry all this had to happen, but you should at least give me a break. It's my son that is dead here. I feel bad about it. I don't intend to take Jacob from you and your husband. I can't take him. It wouldn't be right. Besides, I'm married now with other children. I had to do what I did. Can't you see? It's all right, Mrs. Judge. We're really sorry about your son. Please don't be upset. My wife is a little distressed now. Under the present circumstance, you cannot blame her. I think we should do what Nkewa has uh, asked us to do. We should all go to bed. And I'm sure things will sort themselves out eventually. Hmm? Please, 
sister, she went. Oh, my love, my love. Go and get a sack. Tell me to get carry it. My love, my love. Oh God, oh God, please, please, let her go through this, Father Lord, please, please, I promise I'll never fight her again, I promise I'll never fight her, Nikki. Oh God, please, please, oh gosh, oh gosh, God, please, oh please, don't let anything happen to her, please, please, Father Lord, don't let anything happen to her, I beg of you, please. Thank you. 